welcome to the next session in our python hacking advanced level course which is basically about hacking the beginner cipher now as we have discussed in the earlier session there are two methods which exist to hack the beginner cipher one method uses the brute force dictionary attack to try every word in the dictionary file as a beginner key which works only if the key is in an english word something like a desk or a raven or something like that the second or the more sophisticated method which was used in the 19th century mathematician charles babbage works even when the key is any random group of letters it may be any letters from a to z now in this session we would be writing down programs to hack the beginner cipher using both the methods so the topics which would be covered in this will be your dictionary attacks your kasaski examination calculating your factors set data type and the set functions extend list method and iter tools dot product function so let us start by knowing first how to use a dictionary attack to brute force the beginner cipher now the first we will be using the dictionary attack to hack the beginner cipher now the dictionary file which we have used earlier that is your dictionary dot txt file has approximately somewhere around 46000 english words and it takes less than 5 minutes for any computer to run those all the decryptions for a particular message the size of a long paragraph which means that if an english word is used to encrypt a beginner cipher text then the cipher text is vulnerable to a dictionary attack so let's look at the source code for the program that uses the dictionary attack to hack your beginner cipher so we would be creating a new file and in that using the new file editor we will be entering some code in the file editor save it by a particular name and be sure that you have to place your check english file or your beginner cipher demo which we have earlier created and your paperclip files all in the same directory where you're going to save the current file so first of all let us go to file new file and create here the file for beginner hacking demo now before that let us go to our folder where we have saved all the documents till now so if you look at this we have the dictionary file available here we have our english file is not there we need to copy down that we have the paperclip file which we have created and obviously our beginner cipher demo file which we have used so now one file that is missing over here is your check english file which we need to create or could just copy down that okay so let us do that first so we have this check english.py which we need to import we need to import the beginner cipher demo and the paperclip so let's go here and first of all let us start with the import statement that's first check english next we would be importing the beginner cipher demo so let us copy down the file name directly so that we avoid the spelling mistakes and obviously our paperclip and once we have done this we would start by defining our main method here and here we are going to define a particular cipher text say for example cipher text str is equal to some code there which we would be writing down later then we would be taking here another say hacked message str and in this we would be calling down a function that we will create below that is hack your beginner dictionary func and here we would be passing the cipher text str as the parameter and once we have passed that we would check if your hacked message str is not equal to none then you are going to say print say copying hacked message to clipboard and then we print here the value of hacked message str then we say paperclip dot copy and 
contact message str after that we go for the else part that is if it is equal to none then we are going to print here say failed to hack encryption that would be the statement in our else block and now coming to the definition of the function that we have defined in the main that is we'll define here say hack beginner dictionary function which is going to take obviously the ciphertext str as the parameter and in this we are going to open so we will say f1 is equal to say open the file that is dictionary.txt which is there in the same folder where we are going to save the current file then we say words1 is equal to f read lines. after which we say f close. so we open the file we read everything from that store it in words and then we close the file now once the file is closed we run a loop that is say word1 in your lines and over here we would be creating we open up this for loop and we take here word1 is equal to say word1 dot strip that is remove the new line at the end of it and then we take say decrypted text is equal to now here we would be calling the decrypt message function of our beginner cipher so let us copy down the beginner cipher demo here and in this we are having the function that is decrypt message we had given there let us just try to open up the file which is in our e drive beginner cipher demo and the function name over here we have given is decrypt message str so we will take that same method here and the parameters passed here are word1 and cipher text str 